in this video I'll show you how to make this delicious oven baked whole fish and you will absolutely love it. Hi, I'm Sheila of Bountiful Cook and here on my channel I share with you delicious and healthy recipes to inspire you every week. Now for today I've decided to make this delicious oven baked whole tilapia recipe. If you've never cooked whole fish, this is your opportunity to give it a go. And not only is this recipe super easy, it is also very hands-off. Once you've washed the fish and you've seasoned it, all you have to do is place it in the oven and let the magic happen. And I guarantee you will be in the comments below telling me just how easy and also delicious this recipe was. So without further ado, let's go straight on to making this delicious tilapia recipe. All right, so over here we have three large tilapias. I've gone ahead and actually descaled them as well as cleaned them so these are ready to be seasoned. And you can actually go ahead and use any other fish, it doesn't have to be tilapia, but this is just my choice for this recipe. Next, we're going to go ahead and score the fish. And what this actually is, is just cutting across the fish and creating small indentations that go close to the spine so that when we go ahead and add the marinade or any type of seasoning, it is well absorbed into the fish and you will have a very flavorsome and moist fish. And it should look a little something like this. You can see the grooves very clearly and that's what you really want and this is perfectly done. Next we're going to add some seasoning together to create a marinade. I've started off with some black pepper, some all-purpose seasoning, some cayenne pepper, some paprika, mixed herbs, garlic powder, onion powder, and then we're going to go ahead and mix that all in together. It's very aromatic and you will love this marinade. Then drizzle some olive oil in there. Be generous with it because we do need to coat three large tilapia. So you want to go ahead and mix that until you get a nice consistency. And of course, remember, you can always do away with some of the spices if you like your fish lightly seasoned and not um, as seasoned as mine. But this will be so delicious. Just give it a go and I promise you'll love it. Now it's time to put that delicious marinade on the fish. Just make sure that you work it all the way into the fish. You definitely want to work it into the grooves that we cut earlier. That way you know for a fact that this fish will be well seasoned. So just be a little bit careful as you have cut pretty close into the spine of a fish. So you don't want to have any of the bones kind of pricking you and hurting you. So be a little bit gentle on the seasoning but you want to go ahead and season on both sides be very generous with the seasoning Once you're done, place the fish on a baking tray and make sure that you have lined it with either foil or a baking sheet just to allow them to cook properly without sticking. And then you want to go ahead and place that into the oven for around 20 to 25 minutes depending on the size of the fish. And after 25 minutes, just look how gorgeous the tilapia looks. It smelled so amazing and honestly, I think I could have eaten all three by myself, but I promise I didn't. <laughs> So I went ahead and gave this delicious tilapia a little taste. 
it was so tasty nice and fluffy on the inside and nice and crispy on the top which is exactly what we wanted the marinade did the job you can see how beautiful the color of the tilapia came out and that's exactly why I said you need to try this marinade because you will love it and of course you can serve this tilapia with salad maybe a side of rice or greens or perhaps even make a gravy on the side but either way by itself it's perfect Well, I hope you enjoyed that recipe and if you did, do not forget to let me know in the comments below, especially if you recreate this recipe, let me know. But before you leave, remember I've got playlists over here to my right and over here to my left if you'd like more fish recipes or healthy recipes and of course, don't forget to thumbs up and like this video. And if you liked it that much, you can share it with a fellow foodie and let them know that we're over here on Bountiful Cook making delicious food every single week. But until next time, bye bye.